audience, the question of the day is, should I film with my glasses on or should I take them off? Question of the day. I don't know what to do. <laughs> If the if the reflection okay so I have to like look like this so that the reflection does not hit off my glasses. I think I can do it. <laughs> Hello there guys. So for today's video, I will actually be doing a summer haul. Um, I know it's winter, but <laughs> I went to Dubai like two or three weeks ago now, and so before I went to Dubai, I actually purchased a few dresses from boohoo.com and I also have a few dresses that I bought maybe like a week or two before that as well just from other kind of shops so I just thought that I might as well do a summer haul anyway of all my maxi dresses because either you guys can go pick them up right now because they're probably on sale and save them for you know next year or if you're in Australia I think that they're perfect for you because it's summer there anyway so I thought, you know what, I might just film it either way. Yeah, these these glasses are totally, totally not working. And they've taken off like half my makeup off with it. Okay, it's okay guys, I'll be blind, I'll be blind. I do it all the time basically. <laughs> it's all good. So, I have all of my dresses on these hangers. Let me put, oh my god, they're so heavy, okay. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to start off with all the boohoo.com ones first. And to begin with, I have this red long maxi dress. It's very simple, just a very nice orangey red colour. It's a very long maxi dress and it's got a piece of lining underneath it as well, which I believe it came up to um, above my knees, but you guys can probably, if you can, then you'll see it. Um, in the clip that I'm going to show you and what's cool about these uh, dresses actually is a lot of them is you can actually move this around so if you're someone who wants to wear it like literally up to there you can actually fix it so it goes up to there so yeah you can adjust it which is actually something that I thought was a really clever idea because anyone can fit into this dress my mum tried it on she can fit into it if I gave it to my grand she'd probably fit into it as well I really love this dress they had this in a few colours but I wanted it in red because I don't own any other maxi dresses in a red I wore one like this actually for my prom um, but that one's too big for me now so yeah I just thought I'd pick this one up and the colour is gorgeous and um, I recommend this to you actually it's the style of it is um, I saw it as like an Arabian style because it's very just out there there's no sort of cinching in at the waist or anything like that but it looks so classy that's the thing it looks so good when you wear it I do not regret buying it and I would probably buy this in a range of different colors because I loved it so much next dress is another boohoo.com one and it is this very long peach dress on top it's got this extra little bit of material which is something that is actually a very clever idea because it transforms a very normal simple dress because without this guys it will just be like a plain dress um you know when you get those like t-shirt dresses or something like that it's just like that's the way i saw it it's like a long t-shirt dress just sleeveless kind of thing it's so simple there's nothing to it and i got it in a peach color because yet again i wanted different colored kind of dresses you know i tend to go for dresses that are all a specific sort of color or sometimes i just go for ones with print and i thought it's good to have a little bit of both it's good to have your very kind of printed ones and then your very kind of plain dressed down ones that you can dress up and i wore all of these in dubai so you you know if you want to go check out my vlog i will link that down below i really like this one actually and i know that they have it in loads of different colors i kind of want it in black as well so i might have to go repurchase the same thing just in a different color Next one is my Caribbean dress, as I like to call it, because it just reminds me of something I'd wear if I ever went to the Caribbean. And it's got this lovely print all over. It's um, a very huggable kind of bodycon type dress, and I love it. I thought that I would never be able to suit a dress like this, and you know what? I actually did, and I was so proud of myself. I always thought that, I don't know, I just thought I was too fat to suit it, if that makes sense. I don't know. It's just everyone has things that they're afraid of and I was just afraid of wearing a dress like this because I thought that it would not suit me but it's really really flattering actually the only downside is that I have um, a stomach and I know everyone has a stomach but for some reason 
uh, I was extra bloated <laughs> and so because of that it was like it just kind of ruined it a little bit but it wasn't too bad because I wore this with a kimono and I oh my god I just loved it so much this one has just got this gorgeous sort of leafy print all over it and I can assure you that I will go to the Caribbean one day in the future and I will wear this dress I, I just I have to I have to wear this dress it's amazing it's great and I love it I love the fact that it hugs my body so well and actually makes me look flattering I don't know it's a favourite of mine now. The next dress I have is this uh, maxi dress. This is yet again from Boohoo.com and with this dress it's um it's a printed dress if you have a look at it but the thing is that it's a little bit different because uh, the, there's a bit more of a design to it. At the front there is a zip here so with this zip you can keep it open or you can keep it shut it just adds a tiny bit of a design to it i just really love the print i love the flow of it maxi dresses are one of my all-time favorite kind of pieces to have in my wardrobe because it's just so free like you know when you wear it in the summer you don't want to wear loads of clothes and loads of things but me being limited to what i can wear i think maxi dresses are so good because I'm just free <laughs> underneath it all. I'm just free, you know. I don't have to wear another thing on top and all of that, and you know, just meh. It's just all meh after a while. So yeah, I really like this. This has spaghetti straps, um, and the straps are also adjustable, which is good because they never seem to fit me otherwise if they don't give adjustable sort of straps. So then I have one more thing from boohoo.com, and that is a kimono, which I can't show you right now because I actually forgot it. But I am going to insert a picture of me wearing it. It is such a beautiful kimono I love the print so much my mum actually was just like yeah get that one so I bought it and um, it was supposed to be for my mum but I don't think she ever wore it I'm the person who wore it quite often I love the print I love kimonos as well it's so free it's so it's just something that adds you know some sort of just oomph to your look it's like a necklace you know when you add like a statement necklace into you know when you just incorporate into your outfit and it just suddenly transforms the look I feel like a kimono does the exact same thing I don't I don't know why I just think it's great and all it is is a piece of material and it's stitched in such a simple way but whoever created the kimono is amazing and you are very smart because I love it and that is incredible <laughs> okay yeah then I have two more maxi dresses this one over here Oh my god, one of my all-time favourite maxi dresses. I've never worn these two though, that's the thing. I was going to save them for Greece because I should be going to Greece in um, December, but I think it's going to be cold in Greece. So I will either just have a fashion, you know, photo shoot and um, and then take them back off and wear, you know, clothes that are actually suitable for the more rainy slash wintry side of Greece. Or I just won't take them and I have to wait until I have another summery holiday to go to. But this one over here was bought from Apricot. I th was it Apricot? I can't remember where this one was purchased from. I believe it was purchased from either H&M or New Look. But you know when, um, I think it was H&M for, for some reason. But you know when they have like different designers or not designers or brands and they sell that within the same store I just walked up you know I was just looking at all over the place and I found that dress and I just fell in love with the print it's such a gorgeous very kind of girly cute flirty print and oh my god when you wear this it looks so good I just that's why I wanted to wear it in Greece so much I thought it would be beautiful in Greece but if it's cold I can't wear it the thing about this is it's got a sort of keyhole kind of design here which I have to cover up because I don't really like the way it looks on me and then also the back is beautiful but just not for me and what you can do is you, it just kind of goes across it's like a little crisscross and then you can see a part of your back there like I said it's it's beautiful but it's just not for me so I would have to cover that up what I actually adored about this is the neckline I love the fact that it's got this crisscross design all the way around it it doesn't have it at the back because that part you just tie up but just around here it shapes your neck in such a beautiful way and the design of it because they've used uh, a part of the material which has all different colors on it they haven't just gone for something very simple and so i adore it i just seriously this is one of my all-time favorite dresses and i cannot wait to wait to wear it i am a very girly girl so i love stuff like that then finally i have a dress from tommy hilfiger and it is, yet again, obviously, a maxi dress. And um, 
this one is a sort of Aztec print. It's a creamy off-white sort of colour with jade green kind of uh, pattern on it. And it's also got a belt which you can just help to cinch in at the waist. It's a strapless dress. I think, yeah, all my dresses were strapless. Um, and I don't know, I really like this one. I think the issue with this one was that it was slightly too long. I'm obviously, I'm very short if you don't know, so half my dresses never ever fit me. But I was so lucky with the boohoo.com ones. I don't think you understand how happy I was. The Caribbean one fit just at my ankles, which was perfect. That's where it's supposed to fit. Um, the peach one was perfect length. Oh my God, I was so happy. And uh, yeah, I think, but then I think the other ones my mum had to sign kind of custom for me, but you know you can't you can't win them all I guess but yeah this one definitely had to be cut down I got this in a size 4 and um, American size 4 and it was still massive for me so I don't know <laughs> I had to I had no choice but to get it kind of chopped off a little bit you know to get some chopped off but I really did like this I would have to say I think this one was the most expensive dress out of every single one I believe this one was like a hundred and 45 pounds or something but it's so pretty and you know you can definitely see the difference between how Tommy Hilfiger makes their dresses and how boohoo.com makes their dresses I love boohoo.com it's cheap that's why I don't complain about everything but you can definitely tell like the, the quality and the difference so yeah um, I just love maxi dresses and I know that I wear all of them you know throughout my whole entire life so that's why sometimes I don't mind spending that little bit extra on stuff like maxi dresses whereas yeah I just I mean I don't know I see clothes as a way of expressing yourself and I thought that this was just a very cute dress as well so that's why I got that one I believe that's actually everything to be honest with you um trying to think is there anything else I don't think so but yeah guys I hope you enjoyed this video I hope you all have a lovely day and if you want to go check out my Dubai vlog then I will link it below because I did wear these in my Dubai vlog and I did purchase the, a lot of them for Dubai so well all the boohoo.com ones were actually purchased specifically for Dubai the other two were just purchased just because I wanted to buy them <laughs> randomly and um, I'm gonna try my best to actually find the links of everything and put them down below in the description bar but if there's no link I'm seriously seriously sorry about that I kind of can't help that but I will try my best to find the links and um, yeah make sure to give this video a thumbs up and also comment below which one was your favorite dress or if you have any websites that have amazing maxi dresses or any sort of clothing that you think I'd like because I am on this stage where I'd love to actually try out different stores so yeah just let me know if there's any stores that you think that I would like and I will go check them out so yeah guys I hope you all have a lovely day I hope you all stay beautiful my phone is buzzing in the corner like crazy um, but yeah I hope you all stay beautiful and I shall see you in the next video Bye guys, Mwah. I love you. Open my eyes, yeah, it was only just a dream. Put it down, should I got that ring? Didn't give up on my love, I guess now I got my payback. I think, I think that's enough for today. Oh my god. Just jamming out, just jamming out guys. That is what I do on a daily basis when I come home from college and when I have nothing better to do in my life. When Netflix and chill just doesn't work out, I just sing in my room alone with my beats on. Taste of Tash. <laughs> so then I have one more thing. Um,